Well, schools are closing. That's not for winter break, at least not in some cases. There's been an uptick in sickly kids and adults as COVID, flu, and an unknown virus are making the rounds. Urgent care centers are taking on heavy volumes of folks in the last few weeks. News 12's Jacob Ombi should probably take tomorrow off just to be on the safe side. The holidays are here, but so are the viruses. Schools are closing, and Night Owl Urgent Care says people have been flooding in at all hours with an illness, and that most, if not all, are testing positive for these viruses that are going around. We're experiencing uh, a significant increase in respiratory illnesses, not just respiratory, some GI as well. I also do emergency medicine, so I'm seeing that in our ERs as well. Kind of a mix of COVID, flu, they're, they're about equal. But Dr. Hull says there's one unknown respiratory virus that has been going around that doesn't show up on COVID or flu test, which raises some concern for what it might be. There's also a some kind of an illness that is presenting with more of a GI fatigue and fever type syndrome that is not testing positive for flu, COVID, or RSV. Um, kind of uncertain about what, what that's all about, but it is also presenting in pretty high volume and having pretty significant impacts. While being at night out urgent care, three people tested positive for the flu, so these viruses have came out with a bang as there has been a massive uptick in kids being sick, which has led to school closings. We're seeing about 60% kids and about 40% adults. Okay. It really has gotten pretty big in the last two to three weeks, uh, in my opinion. So late November, I've noticed a pretty big uptick and we're we're, we're taking some heavy volumes now. Dr. Hold added that taking vitamins and taking the necessary precautions to ensure those that are sick get back to the healthiest versions of themselves. Reporting from Udawa, I'm Jacob Ombi, News 12.